What is up everybody? How y'all doing? Good morning. Welcome Poco. Welcome Taylor. Tussie. Gusty. Rune. Dars. Pimmy. Uh Gusty, I don't know. I don't know what the what the what the fuck you did Taylor was about. I, I assume it was a light ribbing that I misread, but also uh Taylor was uh was saying hello to everybody in chat. In case you were wondering what Taylor was doing with the with the groove emotes. Uh, if you can't see those emotes, you might not have BGTV installed, which my computer thinks. I don't know. Uh, I, I don't know. I don't know what's going on there, but I assume that you're chill. Uh, yeah, we got a bunch of uh, animated emotes here. Actually, a lot of a lot of channels that I that I go to use them. Um, it was like a way of getting animated emotes into the chat before Twitch added its own animated emotes, but because it gives everyone like free emotes. Yeah, Moobot is my my bot. <laughs> it responds to commands. But uh, yeah, welcome everybody. How y'all doing? Hope everyone is having a good Sunday. Um, yeah, yeah, tabletop was real good yesterday, Dars. Also, hello to anyone who might be lurking or who might join along away. It is me, PB. Uh, all the music we just listened to was from Sonic Forces, including a couple of remixes from Sonic Adventure 2. Oh, Rune, I've been meaning to directly copy that command from yours for a while now, but I, I just always forget. Uh, but uh, yeah. Man, the whole engine thing. It took me a while to clock what was happening. I was like, oh shit. Rune, Rune doesn't... Doesn't know this. <laughs> Which, you know, I've, I've never refueled an engine either. I just, yeah, I just always assumed you just like put it in. And you need to tick it up. Until it stops. I have no idea myself, so. Uh, everybody stop trying to ban me. Jeez. But, uh, yeah. It was fun. I, I really enjoyed it. I'm looking forward to next time. We'll be uh, sometime in February. Likely the second half of February. Just take up on it to a certain amount here. Yeah, it was... Uh, I, <laughs> I love the fact that we all, we all, like, canonically, in character, work in a, in a gas station. And it's like, you me and the dm don't really know enough about the gas stations and engines to, <laughs> to uh to do it properly um but yeah that, that was that was that was yesterday today we are here for a game that i played a little bit of beforehand uh this is well we'll, we'll get the game started i'll talk over it Did you go to Amigo? I mean, if you feel like it, if it, I've never really, I've never really seen the, like the, the fun of Amigo or anything like that before, but I mean, hey, if that's what floats your boat, have a blast with it. Uh, please. Read my video game. Give me the Drianus. Oh wait, shit, no I started Risk of Rain 2. Accidentally. Shit, I guess we're just playing Risk of Rain. God damn. Okay, we're not we're not actually we're not playing Miss Korean. We're gonna put a quick stop to that. Oh no. Y'all could see my my background.
All right. Come on. Show me. It's still trying to trying to capture Risk of Rain. I've got the I've got the actual game open now, and it's still trying to capture Risk of Rain. Are you sure you don't mean Risk of Rain, buddy? Fucking no. Play. All right. Here we are. Uh, V sync off. Yada yada. Oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh, oh. whoa. Oh, strange. Yeah, this is a uh, side-scrolling shmup by the wonderful team Ladybug, the team that developed uh, Toho Luna Nights and uh, what do we call it? Deedlet in Labyrinth. What's it called? Uh, fuck, what do you call it? Record of Lotus War, Deedlet, and Wonder Labyrinth. Um, this is their next game. It is called Trinith. We saw this. Uh, it was revealed at a Japanese indie press conference earlier today. Not earlier today, sorry. I'm, my mind's all over the place. I'm all fucked up. Uh, it was revealed at a Japanese indie press conference earlier this year, and as soon as it was revealed, it got released. And as soon as it got released, I bought it. Uh, yeah. It was pretty damn cool, like, straight, like, straight off the bat. I was having a good time. Uh, so... We played like an hour of it for a scoop on the same week, on the scoop of PB. And there was one of those games that I decided... I'm, obviously, I'm gonna give this a full playthrough. Dusty, thank you very much. I'll take me a sippy. So we have, uh... Oh, I think I I, just, I... I committed myself to doing a full playthrough of this so much that I, uh... That better, weed. I committed myself so much to the full playthrough that I deleted my save data after the scoop. I remember that. How we doing, Wave? We sounding better? Now you can hear me clearly. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, we saying normal or hard difficulty? What are we saying, chat? Hard. All right, we're sent hard. Doing hard. Let's uh, start with the tutorial. Hey Zeke, how's it going? Thank you again for that uh, that resub yesterday. By the way, I didn't realize it was 30 months. That's a long ass time. So, you've been chosen as Drenus pilots. I'm Layla, your instructor. These Drainus ships are the fruits produced by the technology of the Carlyle em Carlyle? Carly yeah, Carlyle. Carlyle Empire. Therefore, there are many aspects that differ greatly from those of normal fighter jets. But take my teachings to heart. Yeah, the I was playing Risk of Rain last Wednesday. It was like my last open game on Steam. Uh, and I accidentally opened it when I tried to start Drainus. But, uh... You know, if I beat this game, like, early, in a couple hours, I might just play some Risk of Rain for a bit, because that's a fucking good game, man. And if I do play Risk of Rain, anyone who has it on PC is welcome to join me, of course. First, use the directional stick to steer the ship, and press A to attack. Try using A to take down the drones in front of you. Oh, they took Cookie down again, Pimmy? Yeah, that is, that, 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 that's a decent emote, Justin. Well, it's a good thing that, uh, you know, we have two archivists. We have, uh, collected the knowledge of Cookie. 
Man, I hope that gets sorted out. That... It fucking sucks. Anyway. And again, this stuff isn't exactly difficult for y'all. Next is the quintessential Drainus feature. Attack Absorption. Take care, Justy. Thanks for stopping by. Press B to absorb enemy attacks. Nice work. The backflow phenomenon that occurs during the absorption should have destroyed the enemy. This is known as a reflector. The more enemy attacks you absorb, the more powerful your reflector becomes. However, absorption mode has a time limit, so pay attention to the bottom left of your screen. Next is beam absorption. The Drainus can absorb any attack, as long as it consists of light energy. Now gather your courage and press B. Now you're able to absorb beams. I wonder if this game requires a photosensitivity one. You know what? It's a schmup. I'm gonna assume that it does. I'm gonna put one up. Just, uh... Be reasonable. I'll say this once more. The Drainus can ab ab absorb any attack, no matter the power, as long as it consists of light energy. When hit with the beam, consider it an opportunity. However, ships and physical shots cannot be absorbed. Physical shots will be designated with a red marker, so be careful not to try absorbing them. Next, we'll use the energy absorbed to upgrade ship functions. The various functions of the Drainus can be freely upgraded. You currently have two full energy tanks. Use these energy tanks to enhance the functions of your choice. First, press the menu button to enter the settings screen. At the settings screen, go to enhance functions at the top right to display this upgrade list. Use two energy tanks, uh, tanks to enhance the functions of your choice. Then add the functions you just enhanced to the number of your choice. Yada yada yada. yada. Okay, you're all equipped. Press menu to end configuration. Karma, the Prini, Drainus, Ds. How did I not also anticipate a Drainus Ds? Circle of 20 does a <laughs> walk and a run. Uh, yeah, she, she just has like, yeah. Just a, a, a line of soldiers constantly waiting to walk around her. Collecting power-up items will cause socket functions to appear. Collect some power-up items. Happy to pluck that low-hanging fruit. I've heard that. Good job. You seem to be getting the hang of the controls. Be careful. Taking damage will cause you to lose one socket. Commander Layla. Who gave you permission to speak? Can't you see I'm in the middle of explaining the controls? My apologies, but the missing Drainus has been found. Ah, the stolen Drainus. Where is it? It appears to be on the planet Halpax. I see. Dispatch a search party immediately. Roger. Are you listening, thieves? You're probably watching this feed on the Drainus right now, aren't you? We will find you, so be prepared. I'm the thieves the whole time. Jenny, our hideout. Seems we've been found. Looks like it. We have to leave immediately. We have no idea what they'll do to us. Are the cryopods ready? Yes, they're ready to go. We can take off any time. Oh, I love the look of this game. Look at that shit. It's the army of the Carlisle Empire. So they've made it this far. Let's lose them.
Oh god, had a friend trade him to the ship. So yeah, the the use of that reflection mechanic, which I'm uh, I'm now realizing not unique to this game. Giga Wing also had its own shield absorb repel mechanic, although it worked very differently. But yeah, that is like the as you call it the main uh, gimmick of the Drainus. But uh, I, the way the way that it actually works is quite unique. In Giga Wing, it was like a, a momentary attack that you use. In this, it's rude. It's like a, a central mechanic that you're constantly relying on. Oh, that is that is rude. Uh... Hey, what a beat. I did this to myself, so I've been told. This is the community that I've fostered. Whenever since you told me that you hate the word community, I, I, I think of you every time I say it. Printus, our community manager. Alright, let's get some fucking stuff upgraded. I got a shield. Jack's physical shots. Auto deploys against energy projectiles. Uh, that's gonna take three energy tanks. I don't, even, I don't even have three energy tanks. Oh, I would love a bit. A bit. Right, these are physical strikes. Can't can absorb them. But I mean, yeah, I'm guessing you know. Laser attacks, non-physical energy attacks. Uh, are just the nature of warfare in this world. They rely on them more than, you know, physical ballistics. Maybe they're more efficient. Maybe they're better in most cases. And that's why the, the Drainus represents such a threat in the first place. Getting hit. Ah, for fuck's sake. Yeah, this game is a recent release. This came out in 2022. Oh damn, that took way too long. 
<laughs> what up, Sarge? Yeah, OP's dead. Um, oh, for fuck's sake, I didn't realize it was a enemy ship. Yeah, all the characters in Night Shift died off screen. We're never doing it again. Jeez, they really didn't, uh, they did not like that planet very much. V, you take care. Can I do something to turn off the, I don't think I can do anything to turn off the, oh, you can change your movement speed in a menu? That's interesting. Yeah, this does have those cinematic segments that get quite shaky. Um, I'm sorry it gives you some trouble. But you take care of yourself. Whiskey, how's it going? Alright, I have... I don't even, I don't even have enough energy tanks for it. Hmm. Hmm. We'll keep the, uh, energy tanks I got. I'll take you on. Prepare yourselves. Transformation? Is that the henchin on me? So the red tinted things, we have to avoid those, those are physical attacks, our Drenus cannot absorb physical attacks, only energy. It like almost has like a rhythm gimme element. Oh my goodness, I'm so fucking close. Are you me? Is that what we're saying? Yeah, she had like three ships in that thing. Ridiculous. <sighs> D 
died twice. Doesn't feel good. Looks like you managed to escape just in time. I never thought it'd be you who stole the dreams. Irina. Layla. Destroying entire planets? There were all those people living on planet Halpax. The Carlisle Empire shows no mercy. Not even to settlement planets. More importantly, I'll be taking that Drenus back later. Don't even think you'll be able to get away. Signal was cut. They're gonna keep chasing us. Perfect. We've gotta destroy all their polycores. With all their polycores gone, they'll be left without an energy source, rendering them helpless. So they're necessary from escaping for the Carlisle Empire as well. Oh, by the way, looks like you got six energy tanks stored up. Try and hunt in a function or two on your ship, Genie. Commander Layla. General Governor Izumo. How is the search for the missing Drainus prototype coming along? Sir, our investigation has concluded that it's on the planet Halfax. We're dispatching a, hurt a search party as we speak. Search party? Hmm. Tepid as always, I see. Yeah, he's definitely got the, got the face of a friend, this guy. Just destroy the entire planet. The entire planet, sir? With the weaponry of the Carlisle Empire, it's more than possible, isn't it? Of course it's possible, but... I mean... The planet Halpax is one of our own military colonies, and so... So what? You have reservations? You yourself said that they were constantly revolting. That they were out of control, did you not? And now Adrianus has been brought here illegally. And yet they haven't said a word. Is there some reason you don't want to attack the planet? If you can't do it, then I'll do it myself. No. This isn't a job for our Governor General to get his own hands dirty. Hmm. Alright then. There's no room for error. Bring back the Drina swiftly or I'll order the destruction of the planet. Understood. So it was not Layla. What did it? Um. On the even stream in the future, sure thing, Starge. I will do this thing for you. All right. Now we got us a shield. Next stage. We're in space! Not doing enough damage. Space train. Hey, Kamurzi. I mean, I, I... I hope it's all, you know, military personnel. Look, the train star should have me first. Officer. Ah, game over.
We're gonna call out a death. Karma. there for a second but I think actually my shield took it. That guy. It's actually kind of cool, Star. You can you can determine your own like shift movement speed. Fuck off! Ooh. Alright, wasted all my bombs on that guy, but... Not worth it. Yeah, like... That's how you change your speed right there. You open a little menu at any point, but you can also do it from the pause menu. Alright, we got some upgrades to unlock. I want our up socket. So now we'll have two more power ups to put in. That robot lady is incredibly helpful. She tells me when I got super bombs charged, she tells me where my guard meter is fully charged. She just told me I had a super bomb, so I can go pop up, 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 up. And she told me my guard function is complete, so I can just absorb. She's very useful. What's up, socket? Not much. How about you? That we're going. Minin, how's it going? Scooby, I'm, I'm not sure if I said hello to you, but I'm saying hello to you now, Scooby. Brody knows Scooby. Have I said hello to Scooby or not? I don't know. I don't know why I get that in particular with you. Kobe's been here for hours. I haven't even been here for hours. Where do, where do I think I am? I just know that the data disk is going to be in one of these places, but I can't fucking tell which one. Oh, there it is! Yus! All 
Alright, let's get some upgrades on this bad boy. Give me, uh, homing missiles and diagonal rear shot. Uh, Drimbus is great. Uh, uh, this game's solid ass game. Ow! Ow! Fuck off! God damn it. It took. Your health bar and your upgrades are the same thing. So you equip a set of upgrades that you want to bring into battle with you. And uh, whenever you get these little floating gray plates with the blue circles in the middle, like I just picked up, there's another one up there. That is how you get to the next stage of your power up. That's when you unlock the next preset power up that you put on your ship. <laughs> Look, the one thing is that I'm not sure if the laser protects me from... I'm not sure if it, like, shields me. So if I can't erase a projectile, I don't know if it's actually if it's still gonna, like, hit me or not. I've analyzed all of your data. You can't beat me. All my data, my browsing history, analyzed. Fuck! Ran out of my guard. Got him. Oh man, the upgrade flew off the screen immediately. Oh my goodness! Fuck you! Alright, it does look like the super bomb does make me invulnerable for a bit. Ah, shit. Over relied on the shield. Get out of here! Got another transformation, haven't you? It's almost like a rhythm game. I think I just let that thing hit me straight up. Yeah. 
did a can't beat guts. Lap, how's it going? Come in, in. good to see you. Lucky. You're right, sorry, I should also play Mr. Driller. Second polycar has been destroyed. Or left. Hey. Genie. Will destroying all the polycores really change the future? Yeah. The Carlisle Empire would crumble. That's precisely why I've come to this time period. Why did you choose me as a pilot? Because you're the best pilot in the galaxy. You don't seem to realize it yet, but you're even more of a natural than your sister. That, and we share the same goal. Bringing down the Carlisle Empire. I just want to cure my daddy's illness. Back in his hometown. It's the same thing. As long as we're under the control of the Carlisle Empire, there is no future. But I guess even if I do manage to cure my daddy, there's no point in living if it's in constant fear of the Empire. Well... These pods can only stay frozen for so long, so we'd better hurry. Excuse me. I heard that Governor General Lizimo was here in the fortress. Is that true? Oh, yeah. Had a barking like a madman about reinforcing our army. So that's why. I was off duty today, but I got called in suddenly, and... You're new here, so maybe you don't know, but... Governor Generalismo suddenly changing his orders happens all the time. But his decisions are always right. There are even some people who say he can see into the future. Wow, he really sounds like something. Ever since he entered the Carlisle Empire, the Empire has been growing by leaps and bounds. The Empire may even be in control of all of space within the next few decades. All of space? Goddamn. So if they get the entire universe under their control, does that mean like we get, like, better pay? Wow. You really got some balls, huh? Alright, let's see if we can get a better shot on... I would love to, uh, I would love to beat this jailbreak. Um... Where did I see how many... Oh, I have three energy tanks. Uh, I thought I had more for some reason. Uh, hmm, hmm. Let's get a basic five-way shot going on. We'll put that over our three-way shot. And I think our bit should be the last thing. Got two energy tanks. What do I want to put them in? Attack power times two. I have to equip it to a socket though. Really like that. Uh, let's try a formation bit instead. Next stage. Doing max damages. Lap is breaking Final Fantasy IX on the first playthrough. Fucking hell. Steiner. I guess he is. A big damage dealer. Nice, that five way shot. Doing a lot more work for us.
the little walker dudes. Fuck, didn't see that guy spawning directly on top of me. That sucks, that used so much of my goddamn. All my upgrades gone. Ah! Fuck me, that's tough. Hmm. Can I get a can I get a different stabilizer? I'll put five way shot after our stabilizers for now. Oh shit. Ah, oh, man. It's so rough. Hey, what up, Didi? How's it going, my dude? I'm on a ladder, I can actually just switch this back. Which, uh, which jack is he starting up? I'm gonna do my best for my beloved kid little Layla. Oh no. One of these guys. Shield up. Very nice. I have to remember that it's only a shield against energy attacks. Not physical. I love I can just switch to a rear shot on the fly. It's got a bit of that uh, Andrew Gunnarsness in it, in which you can just like equip attacks to hit anywhere on the screen that you want. 
and now that I'm no longer in front of him, I can just switch it to actually... Put a vertical shot on as well. Or can I put on two kinds of bits, I wonder? Can I put on rolling bit and... Same type are implemented when one is turned on, the other is immediately turned off. Okay, so we can't do that. Um... Put on vertical shot in that case. Ooh, that was close. just that I have to hit the side things. I'm not doing any damage to him. What does the actual damage happen? Is the damage done by reflecting? Yeah, it is. Uh, Karma, I don't think that he's... I don't think he was Layla's dad. Because that would also make him our dad, I'm guessing. Some guy who calls his commanding officer my cute little Layla. So... Maybe it's okay that he died. So, it's our military polycore you were after. Through sheer luck, you were able to destroy three polycores. However, I can overlook that. Just give up now. Even with one of our amazing Drainus ships, what good is just one? Your luck is about to run out. Hey, Layla, listen. The longer we keep fighting each other like this, the more we'll both be hurt. You don't want to fight your own sister, do you? I know you're a good person at heart. When we were kids, when you joined the Carlisle army, it was to save daddy and me. I know it was. I have no sister. Layla, abandon that ship and surrender. And I'll let you live. Commander, don't be naive. They're just going to take advantage of you. Who's this? Governor General Izumo. I'll be taking the Drenus. That and your lives. Never underestimate the Carlisle Empire. Well then. Seven tanks. Can I get, can I get another guard socket? And another guard socket. One more of that guard gauge happening. We didn't get the recorder for that stage. That's unfortunate. Showdown. Okay. 
Shit, let me get the upgrade. Thank you. Get out of here. Whoa, cheeky. I'm firing some sort of gigantic laser beam at me. Which, uh, good. You know, I'll just, oh, it's an engine. Okay, that's pretty cool. None of those guys dropped an upgrade for me, that's some bullshit. Edgy, don't do it! Edgy, no! Fucking hell. Did I get hit there? I think I got hit. I definitely got hit that time. I felt that one. Ow, got hit by a fucking door opening. <laughs> My voice decided to suddenly die. Thank you for the FF9. I appreciate it. I appreciate you. Yeah, this game's sick. This is a good ass game. Oh, did I just drain that a little bit late? That fucking sucks. I got an update chip immediately after as well. Give me the shield, please. Yeah, Drenus. Very fun indie shmup in which the uh, the primary or one of the primary mechanics is this little temporary drain thing. Use your guard gauge at the bottom, and you're able to drain uh, any energy attacks. And the more you drain, the more you can output as a counter attack. Caveat being that it is temporary, you can lose it if you abuse it. 
takes longer to recharge if you like go empty. And also it can't uh, it can't reflect. Do I have deal break? Yus! Fuck you, double shot. No need for you anymore. But what I put here instead? That's the question. I only have two energy tanks left. Uh, reflective laser. Gradius was your shit. Gradius is is good shit. I have shot mind stabilizer. But I need something else. I need an EX, is what I need. But I don't have the sockets for an EX. Uh, Alright, we'll keep this as 5-way shot. And it'll upgrade to Reflective Laser. Oh no wait, the Reflective Laser fucking sucks here. We're outside, it's got nothing to reflect off. Give him a terrible music. Um I'm here to support the Sonic and the Secret Rings music. It had some tracks I enjoyed, okay? I will not be shamed. She's saying guard gay Jeff? Is that what she's saying? Every time she goes wah, wah, wah. Wah, wah, wah. Usually respect my music tags. Well that's your fucking problem, man. Wah, wah, wah. We got some Metropolis zone looking ass pistons. Yadi Majin like in Shogun. And Shogun was a good ass game. Shogun was a really good game. More don't respect that lad. Understandable. Wait, what? Can I increase the attack power now? No, we've only got one energy tank. We get energy tanks to get our power increase. After that, we're gonna be fucking styling and sliding. Good thing I increased our fucking guard gauge, because my goodness. Ah! Oh. Okay. Thank you. Pew, 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 pew. Jimmy, unfortunately, you're not the first person to make it. Thank you for the lust vote. My favorite video game is plus. Yeah, ha ha! Gigant shall destroy all. Oh, for fuck's sake! I turned off my guard just as the laser came out because I thought I turned it on too early. Fucking gigant.
Holy shit, they turn into physical objects. That fucking sucks. Okay, so, I mean, that's not too bad. I thought that's pretty cool. Pretty cool as an enemy mechanic. We have to drain the little cubes that he sends out before they turn into physical objects. Or no, there are some that are just physical objects there already. Hmm. Okay, so we just have to... Hopefully tell which is which. Oh, man. We're done to our last little bit of beef. Any upgrades? Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And I immediately take an attack. Let's go! Should have saved the super bomb for when it sends out its next physical attack, but hey ho! Come on, come on, come on destroy it! Oh lord! Fuck! Whoa! Whoa, 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 what the fuck? yourselves a hand. It's thanks to your corporation that the Drainus was completed. Completed? What do you mean? I hadn't mentioned it before, but all of the data from the Drainus prototype you're using is being transmitted here. Thanks to you using the Drainus to absorb energy and collect data, our own Carlisle Empire Drainus is now complete. My sincerest thanks. What? I believe I said I'd be taking the Drainus. After that, I'll be taking your life. Right, Commander Layla? Governor Generalissimo. That's correct. Layla, wait! I don't want to fight you. Transmission has been cut. Must fight. Um, I'd like to ask you a personal question. 
good little Layla. Wow. Commander, that's... I wonder if she's single. What the hell? Are you into her or something? No, not at all. Huh. She'd never give you the time of day. She's super elite. She joined the military at 11 and sped up through the ranks to become commander. And on top of that, she's Governor General Ismo's favorite too. She's way out of your league. I guess so, huh? But sometimes see her looking at a photo of her family. Crying. She probably had a rough life of her own. Doesn't she ever go visit her family? Governor General Ismo would never allow it. He probably wants her to concentrate on the Polycore project until it finally gets off the grind. Apparently the Polycore project was Governor General Ismo's own idea. Yeah. Remote fusion reactors. Capable of providing enormous amounts of power to all parts of the universe. It seems that the plan is to increase the number of Polycores. And put every corner of the universe under the control of the Carlisle Empire. Damn. Where does he even get those ideas? Hey, Sai. I give you a kiss. Mwah. Hey, you. What are you doing standing around and talking like this? Layla, I mean, Commander. The cartridge in the fourth ventilation chamber hasn't been replaced. If you've got the time to stand around talking, then go replace it. Uh, I'm sorry. Yeah, we got a little, uh, we got a little frog buddy. We got ourselves a little frog. Large multi-hit shots. Power up with it using power up capsules. Oh, we can use super bombs to give ourselves power ups? That's pretty damn good. Uh, uh. Um get you another know, card socket. Hey, Kaleo, my dude. What is up? Thank you very much for the raid. Can have a big shout out to Kaleo. Uh, another very good streamer. Playing through the Legend of Zelda series. Well, 3D Legend of Zelda games at the moment. As well as, unfortunately, uh, commiserations to Kaleo for uh, getting back into Final Fantasy XIV. You hate to see it. Kaleo, my dude. Whoa! Is that the year? The year resub? Dude, thank you very much. Really appreciate that. Good ya. Herb, good ya. IRB, good ya. Welcome. Lucky Silver Anova. Good to see ya. I have to take a detour because the postal service. Oh, you're still waiting on, uh. On Twilight Princess. One big old hood of a year. Yeah, please everybody do follow Captain Kaleo. Uh, I greatly enjoy hanging out with him. He's, he's incredibly friendly. He's got a good good energy streamer. That's what I like about him. He's got a, a good ass energy of a streamer. And the chat's like fun to spend time in as well. Played a game that made you poop yourselves? What were you all playing? That Phasmophobia? Yeah, I saw you playing a little Gator game. That's a game that I'm wanting to uh, get around to as well. Yeah, what's the impromptu spooky game? Forewarned? Not heard of that. But yeah, for anyone who doesn't know me from Captain Kaleos, my name is Profound Badness, aka PB, gaming variety streamer from Ireland, cosplaying Isle, currently playing Drainus, which was an indie shoot 'em up released by Team Ladybug earlier in this year, and it's hella stylish, ton of fun, interesting mechanics. Egyptian tomb reading. Hmm. I hope y'all had fun with that. But yeah, here we play a uh, very wide variety of games. Aside from this, we're currently playing Horizon Forbidden West, Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, uh, which I'm, I'm probably going to be completing that tomorrow night, so look forward to that. And uh, Lost Odyssey, which I'll be playing tonight as well. So y'all are very welcome. Please come on in. We're welcome in here. We're friendly. We do like to have a little joke around with each other, but you know, we keep things cool. Most of the time. 
Are we getting all the- yeah, not a chance. <laughs> I'm not planning to get all of the anythings, except the memories. But I play Lost Odyssey on? Uh, I bought a 360 specifically to play Lost Odyssey. I bought the 360 like two years ago, and then I bought Lost Odyssey like earlier in 2022. And I, I didn't even start playing it until December of this year. I, the first game I played, I bought the 360 for Lost Odyssey, and then I played Sonic 06 on it. So it's been a long cursed journey to get into it. Yeah, man, I love Lost Odyssey 2. Revisiting it has been... I'm surprised how quickly Disc 1 ended, but uh, it's, it's been, been pretty fantastic. Anywho, let me show you all this awesome game. This is uh, Drainus by Team Ladybug. They also made Toho Luna Nights, which is available on Game Pass, if any of y'all want to play that. As well as uh, Deedlet in Wonder Labyrinth. Two excellent Metroidvanias. Uh, this is actually Team Ladybug's first game that's based on their original IP. But uh, yeah, we'll see. This, this is sick. So the main gimmick of this game is your shield. You can use your shield. To absorb energy attacks, but not physical attacks. Like physical objects can still penetrate our shield. So it's all about absorbing the energy, dodging the physical, which uh, isn't always as easily said as it is. Or sorry, it isn't as easily done as it is said because you can see at the bottom we have a guard gauge and when it runs out like it just did, you can take damage. It also has like a pretty interesting... Oh, look at that guy sneaking up from behind. It has a pretty interesting uh, upgrade mechanic where you select your own upgrades, which ones you want. And then you just sort of collect the upgrade materials from throughout the stages. So for instance, in fighting this guy, I have decided to switch to shots that fire backwards. But now that he's no longer behind us, I will instead switch to vertical shots. Man, kind of trapped me in there, didn't he? Alright, let's get rid of this guy quicker because he's quite tricky. You can never play them. I always feel like. Fuck's sake. You know, these are some of these games that to me are way tougher than they look. Or sorry, look way tougher than they actually are. Once you get into a rhythm with them, I mean, they don't become easy. But, you know, you learn to play them. Alright, so he's gonna fuck off, I guess. Just didn't get to beat him. That's unfortunate. Alright, at least we're able to play some upgrades. Jesus Christ! Alright, they give us enough upgrades that we've got all of our stuff running. We've got missiles, we've got an auto shield, we've got a little bit dude surrounding us. Oh, that's cool. He's destroying our cover. Oh, we took damage from the missile explosion. That destroyed our cover. That's rough. Oh, didn't see those guys coming up. What's with these green shots? 
No understand them. Oh, oh, rough. Damn. So he's knocked off all of our power ups, which means the next successful attack that hits us will be a death. Get out of here. Nice, he dropped some upgrades. Alright, guys are popping up behind us. That means we swap to rear shot stabilizer. Wait, these are Drainus ships. Oh no! These are my ships. They completed their own Drainus. We've managed to escape into a warp hole. Their Drina should be capable of entering the warp hole as well. Be careful! Oh! So they're going to be doing the reflection mechanic at us as well? That's cool. I like that. So we have to reflect the reflections. Yo, did it just reflect my super bomb? What the hell? Pretty sick. Warning. Where are we? I don't know. I didn't have time to set a destination. We have an unidentified life form up ahead. It's not the Carlisle Empire. Up ahead? I can't see anything. A new foe appears. You're fighting Obelisk. Oh, get the upgrade. Oh, I totally missed the upgrade flying up there. Ah, fuck, how'd I let that hit me? Oh, I didn't realize that they're changing their angles as they...
No way I'm letting this guy do this much damage to me. Okay, we got one upgrade off him at least. Cube! No! Oh, it's a mixture of physical and energy cubes. Fuck! And only one of them seems to take damage. Oh no, we got some yellow devil shenanigans going on here. I have one with physical cubes. Next hit's gonna kill. Got some chips left. Almost ran out of my guard gauge there. Shit. Man, it's hard to hit it. Hard to hit the one cube that's actually weak to be an attack. Hey, Loco, thank you for the beautiful Joes. Ooh, we got it. Was that just now? Didn't look like the Carlisle Empire. I'm sensing a space-time distortion. Perhaps a visitor from the multiverse? Something similar. This is full of mysteries. We don't have much time. We're heading back to the Carlisle Empire. It appears they're heading towards planet E316. Daddy's home planet? Arena. Run away. Layla. Izumo is a terrifying man. He will never give up hunting you down. I'll cause a distraction. While I do that, you... Layla. You're gonna cure Daddy's illness, right? I could hear you speaking through the Drainus. Take care of Daddy for me. Oh, shit. <laughs> Layla! That filthy little pickpocket. I had thought that becoming commander would have straightened her out, but alas. As much as I warned her, 
he's just too naive. You will never get away from Izumo. The mighty Carlisle Empire will reduce you to cosmic dust. I, I won't let you get away with this. Whatever happens, until the final Polycore is destroyed, I can't return to the future. Let's fight. And win. Can I get the power up yet? Can. Thank you for the sleep dogs and for the blesses. I didn't get a new recorder from that stage. I'm missing a lot of these things. Yeah, we got our own little slippy toad in this game. Fuck! Lost my power up as soon as I got it. Oh, we're definitely gonna do a game over on this stage. I'm not able to kill a single one of these enemy ships right now. Oh, okay, I can kill the little guys. I need an upgrade here. Or I could simply die. Game over. It's another death. Take me a little sippy. Rest, recuperate. Okay, here we go. If anyone wants to do that exclamation point in death, you're more than welcome to. Fuck, immediately. Can I retry this stage? Hmm. Restarting after a game over doesn't put you at the start of the stage, it just puts you... Oh man, the sides of those things are physical. Oh man, I ran into the side of the ship. Alright, fucking just kill me. That's another death. Uh, it actually, it can't double flags, and so by all means, fill your boots. Fuck! Oh my god, this. Yeah, I am just. I get a bad start, then I don't get any of my upgrades. Which just makes the next bit all the harder. There we go, that is so much. One little upgrade is all it takes, and it's gone. <laughs> Ugh. 
literally, if I can't do damage quick enough to that guy, he just rushes the screen and kills me. to catch us up with two more deaths after. Uh, that's a death with the TH. Thank you. Let go. Come on, kill it! I can kill it! We took some damage, but we did get a kill. Thank you. I'm gonna keep one more. We got the time. Oh shit! That's real damn fast. This is the boss from the first stage, right? Yeah, it is. Nice the boss in the second stage. Interesting. Cores in the power by some sort of weird anomalous liquid orb. Sure, that's fine.
Fuck, that thing just popped up from beneath me and took my upgrade as soon as I grabbed it. Another core. Whiskey, take care of yourself. Thanks for hanging out with us. Hope the rest of your weekend goes well. This is suspicious. Is that the last of the cores? I think, yeah, we, we fought four bosses that had cores in them, and then we destroyed two more there. That's six. You said there are six cores? Hey! Hey! Would you grab me? Izumo, Izumo shall execute you shortly. That guard charge up fully, please. Okay. Fucking hell. Damn, I don't have the super bombs to clear it. What the lightest path? Oh, I can't believe I dodged all that. Shit. I like go over the dodge button or the guard button a little too early. more ship left. We do have a super bomb. We don't have a super bomb anymore. Oh, damn. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Get him! Get him! Nice! Ah, oh, fuck.
That's tough. See if we can get a better super bomb. Ultra Bimu? Give me the Ultra Bimu. I wonder if I can get any other, like, permanent enhancements. Another guard socket? Yes, please. That's another death, by the way, for anyone keeping time. Thank you. Every game over is a death. Time running it. A hey, cursed. How's it going? Good shout out for cursed blessing, please. I was watching you play some uh, E D F E D F previously, and it was uh, great fun. Makes me want to go back and clap myself. Alright, one thing I would like to do, I don't have any energy tanks left. I would have loved to have taken a physical attack shield. I didn't even try shielding that, that was silly. Oh, we got him. Second hits. No, I thought that was it. That's it. <laughs> raw dogging it. We do be raw dogging. Impossible! I I cannot be defeated. Izumo, you won't get away with it. What you did to Layla. Ah! I won't let you get away with it. But but I'm not going to kill you. Never show yourself in front of us again, ever. That's it. I feel like that's what Layla would have wanted. <laughs> it's a me. Both you and your sister are so naive. And that naivete will be your downfall. I've still got an ace up my sleeve. Your wish will never be fulfilled. Farewell. Damn it. He may be planning to self-destruct and take the entire planet with him. 
Self-destruct. What do we do? There's only one thing to do. I'll put a stop to this. Layla? Layla! You... You would dare to defy me? You're going to hell. And I'm taking you there. No! You dirty little pickpocket. Have you forgotten what you owe me? I fostered you into commander. What I owe you? You simply used me. What would I ever owe you? Stop, Layla. The ship. The Drainus can't handle anymore. Do you read me, Irina? I'm sorry. For all the trouble. Layla! Once Daddy wakes up, tell him I'm sorry. I'm sorry for being such a bad daughter. No! I've lived a bad life, but in the end, I feel like I'm together with family again. At last. Thank you. Layla! Oh no. London? I... 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 I don't think those are the frog's lips. I think like the frog's mouth is just slightly open. Irina... We're here. I hesitated to kill Izumo. And now this. Irina, try not to think about that. Layla was alive. I was this close to being able to save her. It could have saved her. It can't be helped. A person just has to keep moving forward. Even in the face of terrible occurrences like this. Might as well have killed Layla myself. If, if you were able to do it all over just once, would you? If I had even the slightest chance of saving Layla, I'd do it. Okay. I will allow you to go back through time. Voice print check complete. Creating wormhole. We got the fat guy credits. Oh, damn. Ugh. I... I can't breathe. It's okay. Calm down and take a breath. The physical strain of traveling through distorted space is rough. Especially if you aren't a humanoid, like me. Distorted space. Where are we? I reverse time. I use my final remaining time jumper. But that means... Jenny, you won't be able to return to the future. Yeah. I use my return ticket. But this world? Not so bad. I want to see the world in which you saved Layla. But for me, you shouldn't have. You don't have time to get sentimental. You know what happens to this planet. We have to go immediately. Oh, nice. Extra unlockables. Sick. Same exact view as before. It's like deja vu. Not the same. We went back to the past to change the future. It can't be the same. Yeah, 
you don't get away this time, you fucker. A chance to kill all the dudes that I didn't get to kill beforehand. I love it. Data. Was this guy here before? Okay, that's a lot more, a lot more of those bombs than previously, and I think his teal's moving quicker too. No, you don't. Ah, I got hit. All right, what functions can we enhance now? Twin wide, tornade, non-stop. Oh shit, we got a whole lot. Oh, nice! Love a butterfly. Perfect guard, shield protects with the free physical shots and energy shots from all directions. Lolly, thank you for your eternal dedication to the shady dadgies. Hey, okay, so we can't really afford any of them right now, but we'll get them. Yeah, all I love the ship designs in this game. It's a real highlight. Darius Burst. I'd like to play through a lot of the Darius series. I like Darius Burst Chronicles. Uh, I'd love to do a full playthrough of that. Today is my once in a lifetime chance. I'm going to defeat you and get promoted to the top. You're not though, buddy. I'm sorry. Not in the cards for you.
Ooh. Burned him shield, did ya? I feel like if you have a shield equipped and you use a charge of it, picking up another upgrade could just refill your shield. Hydra. Never really played much of the Hydra games. I played Super Hydra, I think, for like a little bit on the SNES, but. Easy peasy. Looks like you managed to escape just in time. Layla. You're alive! Alive? Hm. Are you trying to say you prefer if I was dead? Calm down, Irina. Only you, I, and the Dreams have come back in time, so it may feel a little strange, but this is all happening for the first time for everyone else. I see. You're right, huh? I have no idea what you're whispering about. More importantly, I'll be taking that Dreamus back later. Don't even think you'll be able to get away. Layla, you don't remember... What just happened? Layla! Hey, you shouldn't be doing that. Shut up. Someone will notice. But I mean, you should steal people's things. Daddy said. What am I supposed to do? You're hungry too, right? What's wrong with taking money from the rich anyway? They've got plenty. They can afford to lose a little bit. Fucking let's go, Layla. I'm on her side. Hey, you damn kids. You stole my wallet, didn't you? What are you talking about? Your execution was great. However, you chose the wrong target. I said I don't know what you're talking about. Layla, this is bad. You should just apologize. You know, you've got nice eyes. You want money? You want to make some money? No. Alright, I'll give you the wallet. In exchange, join the Carlisle Empire Army. I'll turn you into a top-class soldier. Carlisle Empire? Layla? You want to live here as a slave for the rest of your life? This is your last chance to get out of this life. What do you say? Want to come with me? So if I join up with the Carlisle Empire, I can make money? Yeah. More than you can ever imagine living here. Okay. Take me with you. Layla! No, don't go! Irina, stay strong. I'll come back someday once I've got something to show for it. I'm gonna free you and Daddy from this life. No, don't go! Layla! Hey, what up, Jesse? We got to... We got pretty damn bar. We reached a... A fake credit sequence. Which is always fun.
We've gone back in time, we're replaying a bunch of the stages, but they're not harder. Yeah, we can, we can now see Shaft, we're heading to the Upside Down Castle. See you. Ow. Big damage trying to get it. Uh, that's okay. I wanted it. I'm upset already that I've missed recordings. I hope that we get like a stage select after we beat the game. Easy peasy. Ultra beam. Thank you. 
Shit, I can punch physical attacks. Okay, we lost a lot of our upgrades doing that. upgrades back. That's nice. Can I buy any decent upgrades? Able to continue firing while absorbing shots? Yeah. Oh, I haven't yet upgraded to that level. your data needs a little correcting, but everything seems to fit my expectations. You are not my enemy. What does that mean? You're not my enemy? Boss fight time? Holy shit! Alright, the bosses really get beeped up. Okay, I need some sort of physical shield, I feel like, next time I fight this guy. Or to make good use of my smart bombs. I imagine it's gonna be tough. Fucking close. Ah, oh, come on. That's rough.
Yeah, enemy design is is great. This guy very much reminds me of a dude from uh, the Darius series. enough tanks to get a function so that your super bomb is actually and it lets you upgrade your power up bar. Caprini, that is something that will, in time, if you hang out here. We'll bold that in ya. Yeah. Fuck, that's two upgrades, three upgrades gone, four upgrades gone, fucking hell. This bit's so tough. At some point, I just, I just run out of shield. Damn, I'm still on four tanks. There we go, four on five tanks now. I can switch my function. Get that emergency power up going. Change our super bomb for an emergency power up. Fuck. 
Fuck, it didn't matter. Oh my goodness, it didn't matter. It didn't Because it starts moving so damn fast. I think the one thing I can do... How about... Wait a second, did that... Oh, I no longer have my emergency power up again. That's rough, that is rough. Change my speed so that I'm still moving fast even whenever I'm in absorb mode, which is nice. like to help me grind levels a bit. Well, I didn't have to attack that guy at all. It means that we might be able to get our power up refill more quickly. Functions, emergency power up, equip it.
Okay, I get it. I get it. He's fucking doing things this way might have made me think a lot easier the entire fight. Oh shit, the third. Fuck. Woo! Finally, my goodness. What's tough? Hey. Jenny, we were supposed to have gone back in time, but enemy attacks and stuff. It all feels much rougher than before. Yeah, that's what's known as the chaos. Chaos? And going back in time, even if you do everything almost exactly the same, a slightly new, different future is created. It's actually what I had feared the most. Things shouldn't change too drastically, but... So, the chances I can see of Layla are... I don't know. It's possible that an even worse future than before awaits us now. What? We've gone back in time, with the Drainus. So that means this Drainus is even more powerful than the first time. Maybe the Carlisle Empire, seeing our armaments, has bulked up their forces as well. One second, a little lozenge. Yeah, <laughs> could have said this before we went back in time, Jenny, but sure. What is this place? Who are you? Are you an alien? An alien? Well, from your perspective, I may as well be. What are you going to do to me? You'll be working in a Carlisle Empire colony. I've heard that you're an especially impressive human on E316. Your skills will be put to good use for our army. Wait a minute. I've got a wife and kids. Listen, it's an honor to receive this offer. E316 is a developing planet. Can't take full advantage of your skills in a place like this. Working for the Carlisle Empire and making full use of your skills will prove much more fulfilling. What the hell? I've got my own way of life. I have my work, and my family. It's too late. You're being sent to the planet Halpax. If you need a family, pick a new one on Halpax. Isn't Halpax that family that got the- or that planet that got destroyed? At the start of the game? Fucking rude. Rude ass game.
Man. You went back in time and rescued it? I was thinking, what if we've like, what if that's our dad? And we have, like going back in the past, got him killed by putting him on the planet. Alright, uh... Butterfly is not working too well for me. I'm going to use Vertical Shot instead. Or... You know what? We've now got a fire. We've now got a set that we can keep firing, even when we've got our shield up. Let's get our final upgrade on this goddamn build. It took me ages to get. Because this deja vu move is that damn hard. Layla, whatever may happen, my love for you is eternal. shot for rear shot
Okay, so non-stop actually doesn't really help here. Attack this guy. Is to absorb and reflect. Oh, didn't see our fucking bullet coming. Like this is not the way. Five way shot. Yeah, I feel like it. Try. So it's our military polycore you were after. Layla, listen. You have to get out of here now. Something terrible is going to happen to you. Arena, try to say and do everything as closely to the first time as possible. Or the chaos will speed up. Something terrible? You should be more worried about that than I. Through sheer luck you were able to destroy three polycores. However, I can overlook that. Just give up now. Even with one of our amazing Drena ships, what good is just one? Your luck is about to run out. Layla, that's not what I mean. It's for your own sake. She cut the transmission. This is bad conversation was vastly different from the first time. Layla. Alright, we got a whole bunch of power. We can uh, enhance some things. I like the rear reflective laser, I'll take that. And is there anything else I can... Blast mines seem pretty cool. stage again probably try and get those off stream Man, those guys are hard to destroy even if you got non-stop on.
non-stop allows us to fire bullets at the same time that we're using our Drainus Shield, which is uh, not possible most of the time. Oh, hey, what's up? Welcome, welcome, Raiders. How you going? At least I hope you're doing well. Uh, yeah, big shout outs to Ika, Paco, Fried Rice. Oh, that didn't work. Spinny Matcha. Back, Tim, how y'all doing? Uh, were you playing more Ghost of Tsushima today? Oh, you're doing some art? Welcome. What were you up to today? What were you arting on? Uh, please everyone do check out Alisa. Really, really, really chill streams. I've been lurking during your, uh, your recent Ghost of Tsushima's until you got up to, what do you call it, Iki Island. Which, unfortunately, I haven't done that myself yet, so I was avoiding that one. But, uh, yeah, Alisa is uh, real chill, plays games, does art. Uh, thank you very much. You're making a new emote. Ah. Kung Kiel. Please let me know if I'm saying your, your name incorrectly. Uh, thank you very much for the follow. And, yeah, thank you for the raid. I really appreciate that. Did you play Go Yeah, I played Ghost of Shima. I played it on the, uh the lethal difficulty and I got the I got the ending but I haven't done the the what do you call it the expansion pack yet the Iki Island thing I really really enjoyed that game that was a solid solid game um but yeah all y'all who are here welcome if you don't know me my name is Profound Badness aka PB I'm a gaming variety streamer from Ireland and a cosplay in Isle Currently I'm playing a game called Drainus. It is the latest game from uh, a little indie, a Japanese indie dev studio called Team Ladybug, who previously made Toho Luna Nights and uh, Record of Lodos War Be Lit in Wonder Labyrinth. Uh, it's one of my favorite indie dev studios ever, and this is their first like original IP and their first shmup. It's funny, lethal, like, it's tough, but it also makes things easier in a way. Like, you can, you, you get killed in a couple hits, but you can kill enemies in a couple hits as well. It just made it really, uh, really dynamic and fast. I loved it. But, uh, yeah, thank you for the raid, Elisa. I hope you're doing well. I, uh, let me show y'all some of this insane game, Greenus. So, if you've played Schmutz before, you know, it might not look too different from things that you've seen. But the main mechanic is that you're able to drain enemy bullets for a short time. We've got our little guard meter done at the bottom. And when you drain, you also reflect. So it's like, it's a mixture of attacking, draining, reflecting, making sure your guard meter doesn't get down too low. Uh, it's a bit sweaty at times, for sure. I've had a few bosses that have uh, got me frustratingly stuck for a bit. Endless. Uh, I, to be fair, I also dived a lot. Like, I'm not sure if you if you've seen the ending of the game or not, but like the final final boss fight. Uh, yeah, I died like. At least 50 times on that. We were keeping time, and it was ridiculous. It was like 50 times because you just dodged so damn quickly. But whenever I finally got the win, it was uh, it was gorgeous. I was loving life. Oh God.
man. This level is insane. Alright, I need to change. My reflective laser is not good enough. I need to make it just a straight up rear shot to hit the guys behind me. Thank god for my emergency power-up thing, I was able to just like tank some of the hits by essentially just healing the damage I was taking. That was a very good investment. You finished your emote? Is this it? Is it the uh... I love that... Oh no wait, that, that's his, these things. Uh... I love that uh, the, the stream you were doing when it's like... You had a whole bunch of people on doing drones. Was that your stream or was that uh... I'm pretty sure it was your stream, right? I'm trying to think, was that your stream? Or was that Kana's? When everyone was on like doing a drawing together. Uh, it was like some sort of like online shared drawing thing. I just can't remember if that was yours or Kana's stream, so never mind. Uh, yeah, looking forward to seeing it. Oh, that was your stream? Yeah, yeah. That was very cute. I enjoyed that. Cursed as hell, but uh, very nice. I hope it gets through quickly. I think you, you get when you get to a certain point, it just like automatically accepts your uh, your emotes. I've thankfully gotten to that point now, so I don't have to wait for it to finish pending. Also, I'm sorry, I know my accent is pretty hard for most people and uh, whenever I play games like this that get me really excited, I talk really fast. So uh, forgive me if I'm, you know, babbling. Yeah, Kana, Kana's also a fantastic artist. He did a really good uh, illustration of Mike Megachoy that y'all might have seen on Twitter. Y'all are so talented. I'm I'm jealous of people who have like artistic talent. Alisa, have you done emote art for any other streamers that we might know? Oh shit, I'm supposed to be shitting this thing. Ah, uh, we're fine. I just had to use all my health to get through it. Not Zack and a VA. The only uh, only VA I know that I know that streams is Greg Chun. But I suppose a lot of them probably stream, right? Oh, you did Greg's. Oh, very nice. Solid work in that case. Very nice stuff. Alright, we got a lot of upgrade juice. What can I upgrade it to? Let's try this homing jet. And I'll try the rolling bits as well. Wait, I can upgrade rolling bits? Yo! I didn't realize I could upgrade my bits. Man, I've been a fool the whole time. 
Chat, don't forget to upgrade your bits. Embarrassing. Also, while we can absorb energy beams like these, the little red things, any object that's marked red is a physical attack. It's like an object and our shield cannot absorb objects. We don't have the technology. We have to be particularly careful of those or that happens. Uh. Got one life left. Oh, thank God. Raccoon. Let me take a little closer look at these. I think my favorite is the headphones. That's so lovely. I love the expression on the, the headphones emote. So good. Right, we have to destroy this thing before it fires, like that. Thank you. Get me out of here. Mm. <sighs> I'm not the boss. Governor Generalissimo ordered us to be vigilant, but you are no match for Gigant. Alright, this is tough because some of these blocks are physical and some aren't. You know what, I think? Do I have enough to buy a new shield? I'm gonna get a shield that can take physical damage for us. That's the one thing I struggle with in this boss fight. For bomb. By a straight bullet. Oh no! What the heck? This is so much faster. Someone help. Oh. Never mind. No stress. No panic. Easy peasy. Rejoice. The Drainus is complete. Layla? Those words. 
Izumo said the same thing earlier. Governor General Izumo? The Governor General would never come to a place like this. Don't speak his name so lightly. But why? A transmission from Izumo had just come through. Karina, this is bad. It's the chaos. The future is beginning to change drastically. Yeah, there's been some time travel shenanigans in this game. We've gone back into the past and... Uh, we might have messed things up. You were supposed to defeat Izumo and save Layla, but as long as Izumo doesn't show up, you'll have to fight Layla. Why is this happening? I believe it was caused by the slightest change in words. The slightest change in actions. And even these minuscule changes add up, they can cause much larger changes to occur. Got another disc. Daddy, are you just going to sit here on the slave planet and wait for your condition to get worse? You can't do that. That's not who you are. You've always told us, if you're ever unsure about something, just take the challenge. You told us it's better to give it your best shot and end up regretting it than to regret doing nothing. But your person is... Is this really safe? Can I really trust that my daughter won't be put in danger? Okay, so it was Yuri. Yuri was contacted by someone from the future. And I'm guessing that he also got caught up in the whole thing of changing the future too much. To be honest, I can't guarantee that. Oh, Jenny was in contact with our dad before us? Jenny's keeping secrets from us? However, in order to prevent galactic war from breaking out in the future, we need your daughter's help. Galactic war. Hey. Daddy, please. There are people who need me. If I'm able to save countless people's lives in the future, then I want to help out. Yeah. Whatever reasons people may create to try and rationalize it, war is evil. And if you're able to stop it from happening, if there's even a small chance of you succeeding, then you've got to do what you can. Daddy. It's okay. Oh, okay, no, never mind. It looked, like, it looked like we were all here for this conversation. I thought Jenny was just getting in contact with our dad. It's okay. I'll be sure you make it to E316. Your planetary compatibility disorder is sure to improve there. We're missing bits of the story because I haven't been able to collect all of the discs. Okay, I only have 2 energy tanks at the moment, I can't really do anything with it. Onwards! Fiction. Alisa, you take care. Sleep well. Thank you again so much for the raid. Uh, if there are any mods in chat, can we get another shout out? Or Ika Taco Fried Rice. What's the Ika bit? Oh. Taco is octopus, right? Ika is squid. So is it squid octopus fried rice? I'd eat that. Hell yeah, I'd eat that. I love seafood. But yeah, you sleep well. Thank you again for the, for the raid and for chilling and just 
You've been a lovely person. Been much appreciated. Ah, oh, man, we couldn't beat him again. Try and attack this guy. Also, it's starting to get to the point that non-stop is actually making it a bit hard to tell what's happening, so I'm gonna use attack power for now. And just have a five-way shot be our regular. There's just a lot of bullets going on here. If I'm firing at the same time as everything else. Damn, they really did just spawn right below me. Cheeky freaky. Oh, I forgot he did that. Oh, and they're so much faster. Get out of here. Oh, we got the Drainus pilots. These guys can do the same absorption ability that we can. It's all about timing, countering their absorptions. Got him. Can we enhance? Yeah, more power bomb sockets. Oh, that's right, the strange alien monolith thing. We've yet to find out too much about it. Are you the CP Bobby left in this equation?
shit. Ooh. Oh, the cubes again. done one complete cycle of its attacks and we've got it down to more than half health. That's pretty good. Destroy it. Yes. That was even easier this time, actually, because of the amount of upgrades we've had at this stage. The Carlisle Empire will not forgive you. It will reduce you to cosmic dust. Layla, are you serious? Earlier, you tried to let us go. You had a heart. The Carlisle Empire will not forgive you. I'll take the Drainus and your lives. Resistance of Sutal. Layla! Something's wrong. This. This future has changed too much. As you have already likely heard, the Council has decided to send you back 50 years into the past. I am aware. Fifty years in the past, you will need to destroy six of the Carlisle Empire's early polycore devices. This looks like us, in the future. The polycores will not consider to be as crucial to the Carlisle Empire back then as they are today. So destroying the polycores will enable us to avoid Galactic War? The Council believes so. After the Galactic War, the various planets of the galaxy were wiped out, and the Carlisle Empire took all of space under its control. After gradually colonizing planet after planet, the only place left not under the control of the Carlisle Empire is here. Someone has to change this history. Allow me to ask, if I do go back to the, ch to the past and change the future, would all of you even recognize this? According to our research on space-time travel, it appears that when history is revised, there is a time lag of a few minutes to a few hours before a new future is established. After that time lag, we will be living in a new future, unaware of what has happened. This means that a few hours after you have changed the future, you will forget that we had sent you. Time lag. It's also mysterious. The time jumper only has enough battery power for two trips. You can go back to the past and then return. That's all. Once you've come back to this time period, if the Carlisle Empire is no longer in power, then your mission will have been accomplished. When that happens, I may no longer be a soldier, I guess. And I may no longer be council chairman. By the way, this mission is top secret. As you know, space time travel is prohibited by Carlisle law, so your mission will not come to light. Nye, go back to the past and do not speak about the mission to anyone but your collaborators. Understood. Although they've prohibited space time travel, it is believed that the Carlisle Empire is illegally traveling through space time. There may be others traveling through time and space beside you, so be very careful. Hmm. Hmm. 
Okay, we're doing much better at the start of this level. Nice. I see you, baby. Kicking that ass. Man, remember when that was a song? That was pretty wild. Managed to get through without taking any damage just by fucking rapidly tapping the Drina C button. Get us a new super bomb. We can always switch back to emergency power up when we need to heal.
that. I don't like that super bomb. That's way too far ahead of us. To emergency power up. Hey, Raichu, how's it going? Good to see you. I hope you're doing well. All right, so. I think we might have another playthrough after this. Cuddling with the Puppo. Oh, love the hair. Thank you. This is my uh, Elster from Signalis wig and face makeup. <laughs> what kind of what kind of puppo you got? Make me jealous. Telling me precisely what I'm missing. Oh, you have visual reference? That is a cute ass dog. I approve. I'm envious. I'm going to execute you all. Get ready! A Ruben Kunuku? Is we a street dog from Aruba? Oh, never heard of that before, but uh, I'm sure he's lovely. What's his name? Wait, is his name also the name of the emote? Is it Ham? <laughs> he just called Pan. Perpetual toddler and your biological dog. Hamilton. He looks lovely. Give him the good cuddles. Layla, what happened? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, yeah, so we've definitely, we're, we've stumbled on some, some dark future nonsense going on here. Thank God that we have a... Shit. Alright. I've got emergency power up equipped. I can just heal myself. We've got a physical shield so I can take three attacks from the physical attacks and we've got our shield powered up enough that I can absorb most of the laser attacks. I just need to be careful. Try and not use my laser gauge any more than I need to. Oh wow we got past that phase nicely. Trouble man but good cuddler. He's allowed to have a little trouble as a treat. Whoa, I'm taking a lot more damage than expected. Heal. These things are exploding into a lot more debris than they did last time. Oh, I don't have my physical shield ready. This could do some damage. Oh, okay. Only one hit. That's not too bad. Damn, I took another hit. I went into it too early without pressing the absorb button. Oh, 
Oh, we got it though. We got it. Here's the last phase. Ah, it hit me. Ah. Nice. Just rest on here during this phase, recover my guard gauge. Excellent. I should have been shooting the whole time, I don't know why I wasn't. Oh, that hurt. We got her. Oh, there's someone else? <laughs> Watching two sisters part. What a show to behold. Izumo, I'll let you in on a secret. What you were seeing was a computer-generated version of Layla. The real Layla has long been locked away. For treason against me. Or rather, for future treason. How do you know about that? Jenny, hmm? Did you really think that you were the only one who'd come from the future? I too am from the future. And I can also use the time jumper as well. And more than you at that. What? I used the time jumper at the moment of the explosion. I went back to the past before you and Lay uh, 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 before you and had Layla detained, and then I enhanced our army and waited to ambush you. I told you I still had an ace up my sleeve. So that was it. The ace was the time jumper. I thought he was going to self-destruct. Self-destruct? Ha! Do you really believe that I, Izumo, would launch such a petty attack? Victory depends on who is best prepared for anything. Remember that. No one is coming to save you this time. Now the time has come for your execution. Our final, final, final boss time. Petulant little insect. Now I am going to reduce you to cosmic dust. This is the weapon that tore the planet Halpax to shreds. Even the Drainus is no match for it. The beam's energy is too powerful. I can't absorb it all. Don't you give up, Irina. Together, the two of us can take this attack. Layla! You... But how? How did you escape from prison? Hmm, I wonder. Knowing that won't help, since you're about to die anyway. Ah! You've made a fool of me for the last time. But, but I've got an ace up my sleeve. I can use a time jumper to return to the past as many times as I want. Oh no, you can return to the past freely. Huh? Where is it? My time jumper. It's gone! That time whatever thing. Is this it? You. Where did you get that? You're the naive one, old man. I'm just a filthy pickpocket. Remember? 
Oh, they brought it back. Layla. Of course. When I detained you, you grabbed onto me. That's when you took it. Took you long enough to notice. Damn you! We did it! Surprisingly easy last, last boss. This is Earth. The planet Daddy was born on. It's so beautiful. In the clean, uncontaminated air. This is sure to help with Daddy's illness. Jenny and Layla. It's all thanks to you. I did it for myself. I don't deserve any thanks. <laughs> we were in real danger back there. And Izumo had returned to the past before us. That means when the decision was made to go back to the past, it was right in the middle of a historically corrective time lag. Had we not chosen to return to the past just then, we would have ended up taking on the further and reinforced Carlisle Empire with our own weakly equipped Drainus, and we would have lost. By the way, Jenny, you're from the future, huh? In that case, here. I'm gonna hand this over to you. Time jumper. Are you sure? I don't need it anyway. That's great, Jenny. Now you can return to the future. A new future, free from the tyranny of the Carlisle Empire. That sounds nice. Jenny? You're... you're fitting away. Well, looks like the historically corrective time lag has caught up to the future. The future in which the Carlisle Empire rules over all of space has disappeared. Mission accomplished. Historically corrective. What do you mean? I'm a humanoid, created to fight against the Carlisle Empire. Once the Carlisle Empire ceases to exist, then so do I. The future has changed. But, no. Jenny, we've come all this way together. It can't be helped. Goodbye, Irina. Layla. No more fighting now, you two. Got it? Jenny. But... History has changed. I believe that's what's happened. Irina. Our future will change too. No. We'll change it ourselves. Layla, you and me and daddy together. Let's make a new history here on this planet called Earth. Jenny! You know, I, I expected the plot to go elsewhere. Ooh, new game modes? Yeah, solid game. Good stuff. I'm sure there's more secrets to be found in the lore by collecting all of those records. Uh, but I thought that the plot was going to be that Jenny came back to the past to have us destroy the Carlisle Empire's uh, power. But I thought it was going to be because Jenny was actually part of an enemy race that was fighting the Carlisleans, Carlisleans, or however you say it, in future, and wanted to depower them so that they could invade and take over humanity. And that's what I thought that the cube thing was. I thought the cube thing that we fought was actually, like, the in potentially invading enemy force. But, you know, it's cute that Jenny is still our buddy. That's fine. But yeah, this also in Xenogears, that's true. Oh, did this take us right back to the, the final fight again? What are the new game modes? It's our new save. Ridiculous. Ah, and hard mode. Let's see how far 
Use our export of this video game outside of Earth in, in violation. <laughs> That's cute. They're doing like a their own arcade mode opening thing. Man. Let's see how far we can get in arcade mode. I like that. That's cute. Seaweed, thank you for the Stanley Pierables. Yeah. Okay, we can still, we can still. Oh, I love that the the grind tank gets picked up by the hurricane. That's a very easy detail to miss. Ooh, I kind of grew to rely on my ability to heal myself. Not I don't have it. Yeah, the heal upgrade is is ridiculously good. which is unfortunate. Oh wait, the stage isn't even done yet, is it? No, it's not. Oh, I'm not allowed to upgrade right now. I see. That's what the bottom right hand corner means, I guess. Gauge max. 
only took me an entire playthrough to figure out what I was saying. Oh, oh, that's crude. That's crude. Rude. Is that a timer? You have to defeat it in under this time in order to get like a... Uh an upgrade from it. Nope. Oh, maybe it's the time bonus in score. Lost a life due to. What do I say? Dumbness? I don't have any energy tanks left. That's fine. Shield and guard gauge upgrade will do me fine. Super bomb. No, I accidentally quit out before I could upgrade my new power. That was silly. Especially when I just take two hits immediately from this guy.
Oh my goodness. We got raided by Mr. Taylor is good. How you doing, my dude? Thank you very much for the raid. What were we playing today? Because did you beat Yakersers? Can we please have a shout out? What's wonderful Taylor is good. A uh, companion I will always want in the big sweaty streamer bed with me. Oh, we've been drained, Daxa. Uh, we've been drained. I beat the game story mode. Now we're doing like an arcade run through, which is like you only get so many lives to uh, to complete the game. And uh, yeah, Drainus is damn good. Solid time. Also, GG's beating Yakuzers. I shouldn't be looking at chat when I'm fighting a giant goddamn mech. Oh my god. Port, how's it going? Okay, so this is our last life, and I just took a hit by hitting the thing physically with my face. Please, one of you feed me an upgrade. Oh my goodness, I'm, I'm taking hits. I'm done in my lowest piddly form. This is awful. Man. I forget that this is just one big stage. Go from the train to making our way inside a space station. It's pretty wild. But yeah, no, this game very fun map. Very uh, what's the word? What is the word? I'm looking for. Very bombastic. A lot of focus on, you know, shit that looks cool. And it also plays well. It's a, it's a good deal easier than a lot of shmups that I've played on stream. But uh, that's only because, you know, it allows you to continue things from like right when you died. Ow. That fucking sucked. I'm not moving quick enough. It, it's actually, it's a game that gets easier as you go in. When you're playing like the normal mode, in which you have like infinite continues. Because you can upgrade your ship so much. But the arcade might be where the, the challenge is to be fun. Looking at this. Please, please, please let me pick up that upgrade. It definitely has like fun ass stages, really cool anime and ship design. Uh, the main gimmick where you have this shield that can absorb and deflect energy attacks is really damn good. But of course, it can't deflect everything, it can't deflect physical attacks, so you still gotta be careful. Oh, I got an extra life somewhere along the way, that's good. Not that for me. Oh no, it's the dragon. I had difficulty with this guy. Well, I mean, I, I had difficulty in, in deja vu mode. Maybe this regular ass mode will be not too bad.
Oh, I took a hit. I didn't like that. All right, here's one gone. I didn't get to pick up the upgrade because his head was off screen. Love that for me. Nice, got the time bonus in that one. Shield back. Okay, nice. I essentially skipped a couple of his phases, like doing damage to him quick enough. Love that for me. Excellent. Let's fucking go. Uh, weekend's going not too bad for me for it. I didn't get what I wanted to get done this weekend. I was hoping to complete a, a script and publish a video, but I'll be trying to do that on Monday and Tuesday instead. Because I had just all family visiting all yesterday when I wasn't streaming. Um, which is a real shame. I was looking forward to uh, getting some work done, but... Hey ho. Ah, uh, taking the emergency power up. I'll take rear shot. Oh, well, I didn't even read that first message. Pretty normal Sunday here. Visited your parents. Played some Elden Ring. Second playthrough. We're gonna set up third. <laughs> What's a parallel or parallel playthrough? So you're doing two playthroughs at once? Is that, is that what that means? It's insane. Tinker with your headlamp and put it into operational readiness. Enhances your nighttime capability. The nighttime capability of what? So ominous. Sounds like you're creating some sort of. Ship upgrade. It's, it's a little upsetting, not gonna lie. Uh, I was very much looking forward to, you know, just getting, getting, getting it started, you know, getting everything working. But, uh, it's okay. I will not let it deject me too much. Oh fuck, I just realized you have limited you have limited pauses in arcade mode. In fact, I think I just used my only pause because I was thinking, what super bomb do I have equipped? Let me check. <laughs> but we don't check. We don't check. Okay, okay. Yeah, I was thinking that in the in the regular mode, you could really quite cheese it by constantly switching to the setup that best suits your current needs, which is what I was doing. But arcade mode says no. You get to change once this level. Better make it a good one, which I kind of respect. What was the script thing? Uh, just doing like a little YouTube review. I'm trying to do little reviews for every game that I beat on stream for uh, 2023. 
as well as like, there's a bigger project that I'm working on alongside it, which is nearly complete in script form, but it's going to take a long ass time to actually edit the video. So I'm giving myself like, if one of us are doing these like shorter projects. Video reviews is shorter projects while I'm working on my longer thing. Oh man. Annoying that just a, a little nudge lost me some health there. Yeah. I do have that in like the form of uh, an Excel sheet, just like showing the games that I've beaten, but... It is nice to have it... You know... In a, I guess, a, a more complete form. Also one that helps me practice video editing, which I definitely do want to do. Yeah, it can be very, very, very time consuming. That's for sure. I'm still, I'm still just like very baby stuff at the moment. But I'd like to take the opportunity to learn to do more uh, complex things. damage. got hit by that physical attack. Alright. He's that too early. Okay, literally even the super bombs don't hit don't hurt this guy. It is literally just green attacks. Oh, never mind. Got him. Ooh. Nice, we're gaining lives. We're storming through it. Oh, I just realized I kind of equipped the bits at the same time that I've got. I think I prefer the bit to the homing missile. Or I could put another power up socket on. Yeah, I'll do that for now. Rolling bit. Alright, on we go. 
Yeah, that is, uh... That's a big part of it. You know, thinking critically about video games is something that I've done for the vast majority of my life. For just my own sake. It would be nice to turn it into something. To say, behold my works and despair. Oh, nice. We got our upgrades. And I lost one immediately by getting hit. That's cheeky. That comes out too quickly after the warning comes up. Oh. It'd be nice if one of those guys dropped an upgrade, but okay. I can't believe I didn't take any damage there, that's insane! Oh, took damage that time. Two hits. Man! Heal myself too much. In case you're wondering why I'm like absorbing things when there's nothing to attack on screen, the more you absorb, the more quickly you earn your uh, your energy vials that you use to upgrade the, the ship as well. Okay. 
Uh, what? It's, it's a weird one to rank it against the other Ladybug games just because of, like, you know, how different it is. I let go of my deflect early. That sucks. Uh, I still think Toho Luna Knights might be like my favorite by them, but I think this is a, you know, a damn good game all the same. They haven't missed, that's the most important thing. Why did I take damage there? I don't understand. I must have just bumped into it. I don't get an upgrade from that. Very rude. Nice. Fully upgraded. Fuck! I forget that the thing spins around and does damage to you. Ah! I'm 
Come on. Got him. So close to getting him in the timer. I was really, really close. Alright. I think of a few upgrades I can make. No lives lost. Pretty good. Do the jailbreak, thank you. And let's get some bits in there. Not a super bomb socket. Man's got shot. Man's got shot. Oh shit. Hmm. I've I've got all my what what do I not have? Okay, I could add an EX. Yeah, next time I'll, I'll add an EX. Fiction. If I can even beat the first run in arcade mode, I'll be pretty happy with that. Taking that damage. Nice. Oh, I can't believe we didn't get him killed after all that. Is our arcade run going? It, it's good I haven't lost a life since the first stage. I'm still pretty good. Close. 
Time to fight the Drainus units. Nice. Got all the prelims done. I don't think that actually reduces how many we have to fight. damage from these guys. Okay. Kill time. Kill might be the one that actually gets me here. Never mind. Once I got the right 
super move on once I got the heal on. Suddenly I'm not as worried about this guy. Right, what I want. What a girl wants, what a girl needs, what a bit beep 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 beep. Uh, I'll take attack fire. Healer gets it. Fuck. That was not... Not good. Okay, we got one of our upgrades from it, thank you. Fuck! Fucked up my time in there between the super bombs and the shields. I would be at full strength right now. Fucking up my guard timings, which is unfortunate. Fuck. 
Okay. Final fight? I think this is the final fight. It is. Lev, did you ever try an arcade run of this? Fuck, 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 fuck. Taking damage. Doesn't matter. He did. No. My sister. He did.
But we can't stop it from happening. We can stop my sister from dejin. All we gotta do is go back in time. Oh, it's really not going to let me menu. Cheeky. Very cheeky. So now we're in deja vu mode, which is team levels, tougher enemies. Fuck, I crashed into the ground on that. That's frustrating. Nice! Didn't take a single hit from that guy, it's the first time I've done that. Not that kind of dream, I think. Shit in this chat, I tell you what. Thank you. 
Till you boy. That boy ain't right. There we go. Yeah, we did this level. This is the deja vu. We've beaten the game in arcade mode. We'll, we'll beat, we beat the game, then we beat the deja vu mode, which is harder versions of all the levels in the true ending. Now we're doing arcade mode where we don't have infinite lives. We've already beaten arcade mode, and this is like the deja vu. How'd it end? Uh, abruptly? Um, yeah, it was fine. I don't, know, I don't know how to answer that question. Decent? Is that right? Yeah, it was, it was a happy ending. I don't know how much you were paying- like, it depends on how much you were paying attention. Did we kill the nice looking result? Yeah, we find out that he also time traveled back with us. Which was why, like, we, we, we tried to change the future. Our sister sacrificed herself in order to save us at the very end. Um, and we tried to go back in time to stop that from happening. But whenever we got back, everything was way stronger than we were expecting. And it turned out that was because that the, the, ult, the enemy guy also had the power of time travel. But uh, our sister this time figured out what was going on before she got killed. And uh, showed up at the end to save the day, essentially, after we had taken care of enemy dudes, big ship, and he was going to try and do a time loop one more time. You're off work, literally not watching the stream. Well, either way, you got the whole goddamn lore anyway, so... Do with that what you will. Didn't even see that goddamn physical thing sitting directly in front of me. Oh, 
We'll forget it immediately. No, I want... I want a book report. You made me say things. Noise. We're doing well. On oh, my autobiography. In a chair gaming is going to be the name of my autobiography. It will also be most of the contents of said autobiography. We lost the shield, but we got through that fucking absolute mess without taking any actual real damage. That was the purpose of the shield. Why are you sagging at me? By what right do you come into my home, Sag? fucking let that happen. Silly. Silly business. <laughs> this one forbidden hack can break a streamer forever. God damn! Melted that base. Let's go. That's the one I was worried about. Jeez, this wave cannon is too damn strong. Wow, that's the boss I was worried about actually taking me the most tries. In deja vu. Uh, 
Turns out I'm the best. damage. Wow, dude disappeared right in front of me. Probably missed the warning sign to be fair. life lost since the first level. This ain't good. Oh, come on. Oh, I lost the ability to play. the wall when I would have got the shield.
Come on. There we go. Stage four. Only two more stages to go. actually. Showdown. Hi, Bussy. No! How are you doing, the crits? I was uh, peeping a bit of your your stream with Johnny Quick. Seemed like y'all had a good time. Playing a Power Washer Simulator, which does look like it could be quite zen. It's on Game Pass. I'm not sure if I'm ready to uh, dip into that world just yet. I don't know if I have what it takes. But I kind of enjoyed watching others play it. Oh my goodness! Who ridden? Who that is? Rune Tooth. How you doing, my dude? Welcome. Welcome, Rune Raiders. Welcome to the Rune Raid. You're all very welcome here. Can you please have a big ol' shout out for uh, the one, the only Rune Tussie? Founder of the streamer bed.
I think all my mods are, uh... Fucking about and find an item. I've never heard of Lunacid, but... Now that you've, uh... You've prompted me to take a look. Wait, that's not the right rune to... Does not have an underscore. There we go, that's the rune twist we all know and love. So, please do feel free to click the little heart appearing at the top of the stream. You peeked at runes and you're like, looks like I want to play it. I'll, I'll check it out, I've not heard of it. At least I don't think I have. Let's check on Steam real quick. Lunacid? Nope. No, I don't have a voice list or anything. First person done- Oh man, you're on fucking- Monomyth got this man salivating. Oh shit, I forgot arcade mode. I can only pause once per level. What have you done to me? What have you done to me? So can we expect some King's Fields as well? I know you've already Eternal Ring. Did you beat Eternal Ring? Or did you just, uh... Oh, fuck's sake. My focus is all over the place. I'm all flustered while the runes with being in here. But yeah, I've beaten the story mode of this game. I'm now doing arcade mode. In which you only get a set amount of lives. But you can gain lives throughout the stages, which is what I've done. V, oh my god, I can't believe you would say this. Fuck, I got hit. Funny call back to chat when you said the exact same thing like five hours ago. I mean, of course I remember this. Oh, I can't believe I took a hit by letting go of the fucking thing early. No way. Give me an upgrade, thank you. Ow! I hit that for me. Oh no! Yeah, this. This is not a game in which we are allowed to chill. Man, I might have fucked my run up. I might have fucked my run up because it's a really hard fight. goodness. Was hard work fine in the end? Uh, yeah, it's, oddly enough, it's a game that gets easier as you get it, as you get further in it. 
with the exception of arcade mode. I might, I might be kind of fucked. Okay, we got our wave cannon. That's good. Okay, nice. We got some power ups. We might be okay here. What do you do? Oh no, are you the guy that spins fast? Fuck! My time was off, so I took a hit. Fuck, I took a hit. Damn, as soon as I got the upgrade, I took the hit and lost it again. Fucking die! Woo! Oh! Take care, B. Go get you. Have uh, I don't know if you're for a lie down or just chilling elsewhere. But thank you very much for hanging out with us. Alright, I think guard absorption is going to be stronger from here on out. And I think that's, that's it. That's the last.
the last real upgrade we can make for the game. It would be nice if we could like use our energy tank to enhance our functions. I guess I can by... No I can't. Well I could use it to power myself up but you can't just use it to power yourself up from the of it. So here we go. Fiction, second last stage. Ah, fuck. I forgot that it turns into bullets when it dies. Fuck, I'm taking too many hits. Y'all need to drop some upgrades, thank you. Yeah, you can uh, you can upgrade your your bars. Oh man, is this where I'm gonna die? Is this gonna be the end of it? The end of old PB. Fuck it, we're spamming super bombs to get past this guy. Fuck, I think this might be it. Okay, Ultra Beam, Emergency Power Up. Okay, nice, we're at full par. We were at full par. Fuck! Okay. This healing skill is gonna carry us for the rest of the game. Alright, here come the other Drainus models. Luck to me. Okay. 
Took my drain off thing. Time for the cube. Cube. Oh, I don't know if I can make it through this last level. There's like nothing that I really want to... Like, enhance with. I like my homing jet. I like my rolling bit. I like my guard absorption power. Yeah, these two are like the... Yeah, we're just going on with this build.
So far, so good. Okay. Full super bomb, soul power. Haven't gained any other lives, but I think that might be enough to get us through it. Oh, fuck's sake. Oh fuck, I forgot about these guys. That's good. Good 
Here we go. Final boss. I've got three lives left. Full power up. Half my super bombs. <clears throat> or maybe just under half. Yeah, just under half my super bombs. Now I have my super bombs. Wasted. Phase. Not too much difficulty. Yeah, with the right strat, you can turn that fight into just a DPS check. My sister.
Once again, bad end. We are in London. Ooh, there it is. Greenness. Hard mode. And arcade mode. Arcade mode first try. Not the hardest shmup for sure. But also, I was playing my ass off towards the end, so I'll take it. Real gamer hours, indeed. Who's Carrie? Cypher, Manso, I wonder if these are, oh yeah, Gigant, yeah, these must be the, the other bosses, pilots that we fought. Man, feels good. That is Drainus, defeated, no longer, Dunzo. I might try and get all like the little hidden lore things off stream because uh, we missed a few of those. But uh, yeah, that is gonna be it for today, at least for Drianus. Uh My evening stream might be a little bit late just because me being late to the stream, which by the way, not my fault. I had a bit of a, a crisis on my hands in the form of it was cold outside and my nose started bleeding everywhere. Uh, so yeah, as a result, Lost Odyssey might be in her between 30 minutes to an hour later than planned. Apologies for the wait, but it will be happening. We will get at least three hours of Lost Odyssey in tonight. Um, it, it, don't worry, actually, it's just, uh, it's just cold, dry air. Next one, more susceptible to nosebleeds and it was cold and dry. And thus, the nose did bleed. Uh, but also, I had just drank, like, coffee. So the bleeding took a while to stop because caffeine, you know, fucks with that. Uh, but it did stop. <laughs> it did stop, thankfully. Um, but that, that's not what I'm here to talk about. I'm here to talk about the fact that I fucking smashed it in Drainus. Smashed it. What a fun game. I would, I would be happier, you know, with more shmups that... You know, we're a little, still, still pretty tough, but, uh, you know, manageable, and also the upgrade system in that game. I imagine that the hard arcade mode might actually be the hardest, like, bit of all. Since by the time you get into the hard mode, aka the deja vu mode in the extended run, you've got quite a few upgrades. But yeah, Drianus smashed. Drianusi, absolutely demolished. And uh, yeah, I'll be back again around 8 or half 8 p.m. GMT for Lost Odyssey. But uh, for now, we're going to go say hello to Jimmy McGinger. Real cringe hours happening. Oh, no, wait. No, it's Carla. Carla's playing Carla Souls too. So, no cringe hours. Just, uh... I mean, you can do what, what Karma put down if you want, but I'm personally going to say Carla Souls with little squidgies, because we like the little squidgies. But uh, yeah, thank you everybody for hanging out. Thank you, Runetooth, Taylor is good, uh, Alisa aka okay, Ika Taco Fried Rice, and Captain Kaleo for the raid. Captain Kaleo for the big year, big year resub. Uh, uh, I, 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 I need to thank him properly for that. And, uh, yeah, we had Conkeel with the follow as well. So, everybody, y'all take care of yourself. Enjoy some Carla Souls. I might see some of y'all here in a few hours. But uh, until next time, 
Take care. Be good. And bye bye.